Why do we get palpitations during the perimenopause and menopause? You know that fluttering sensation that you can get in your heart. It can feel like it's skipped a beat or suddenly it starts to race really quickly. You don't know why. So usually it's down to one culprit and one culprit only. And I'll just go through very quickly why this happens. And guess what? It's that pesky estrogen again. Before I go on, my name is Jen. I'm 52 and I rant about the menopause and I share tips, hacks and my own experience of going through the menopause. And if it sounds like my content might be useful, then do drop me a follow. As estrogen levels drop going through the peri and the menopause, this can overstimulate the heart and estrogen actually helps to regulate the entire cardiovascular system. And so you can get that fluttering sensation or you suddenly feel like your heart is racing away and you just don't know why and you don't know where it's come from. It can happen in the middle of the night when you're watching telly, when you're watching a film, when you're going for a walk, you name it, it's the most random times. Now, this has to be one of the most horrific menopause symptoms ever. At one point, I was getting hundreds a day, and this went on for about three or four months during this particular phase. And the only thing that stopped it was HRT. And guess what? After two weeks, they were reduced. And after about four or five weeks, they completely stopped. Yet, the cardiologist poo-pooed it and said, nothing to do with the menopause. So if this is you, you're not going mad because this is definitely a menopause symptom. And actually, just before your period, if you're still having periods, estrogen levels drop even further. So you tend to get a few just before your period, like I do every month, and that's fine. It's just when I was getting them every day, all day for months, it was absolutely horrific. I just couldn't cope with it. 